Hey guys, so this isn't a video I normally make and I'm going to try not to edit this video as well. But I wanted to make this video just to kind of give you guys a little reminder to check on yourself and um, to do like more than what the typical, I guess, self care um, that everyone talks about. Um, I haven't been alone like this by myself for over a year. Um, either when my boyfriend's gone, I'm with Lily by myself, or when we both don't, whenever I don't have Lily with me, I usually am with my boyfriend and we're running errands or going on a date night and stuff like that. Or if I'm not with either of them, it's because I need to go run errands with my family and it's just much easier to not have Lily so my boyfriend watches her for me. So I'm never not with somebody. I'm always, always with somebody. Um, and for the longest time, my anxiety um, felt like I needed that. But as recent events <laughs> uh, of just me, I realized that I need to, I need to be alone. Um, I was always such a loner before I had my family. Even when I had friends, I would come to the spot where I'm at and just be by myself. Um, and I would be out here all the time in this, in this exact place um, and just meditate and just chill, listen to music, draw, take pictures. Um, and so, I haven't been the best mother and I haven't been the best girlfriend and I I don't think it's a bad thing that I realized that I think it's a very very good thing I realized that and um, I think it's good when you can call your own self out on the way you've been and I just need some time to be alone and you know, I don't ever have that. I don't ever have time to just like check on myself and I haven't had that for over a year. Um, so I decided today it's gonna be the day I went on a little bit of a drive, listened to my music, uh, sang my heart out um, as loud as I could, didn't care because I finally didn't have somebody in the car with me. And then I came to my spot and I've been sitting here and I meditated for like five, six minutes. And honestly, just those five, six minutes, I feel incredible. I literally feel like a weight <laughs> has been lifted from my shoulders. Um, I don't know why, but I just, I think just going with life day to day and always doing something and always having to like think of what I'm gonna be doing next or what I have to do next or um, upcoming appointments or uh, scheduling or figuring this and that out and just never having time to I feel like pause. Um, I think it just got to me and I just stopped having patience and I have been very angry and I don't like feeling angry. Anger is the last emotion I ever want to feel. Um, and I don't know why, but just the past few months, I've been feeling anger first. Um, I haven't felt sad in a very long time. And it's a really weird feeling. Um, and I've just, I like I said, I haven't been the best person, really. I've been on a very short fuse. And I don't like that. I'm usually a very calm, understanding person. And lately I've just been kind of not myself. And I've just been short-fused and <laughs> anything just angers me. And I don't like feeling like that. So I decided I'm going to take control. And I'm finally going to think for, think for me. Sorry, there was a bug in my face. <laughs> and um, take care of me. Um, because if... I gonna be this good mother and this good girlfriend I I need to address when I am going through something and I know that only I can figure it out <laughs> so yeah and I haven't cried in a very long time and honestly like it sounds weird but while I'm by myself I 
I want to cry. <laughs> I, I like want to, like, I feel like I need to force myself to cry. And all, although weirdly talking about crying is making me want to cry. Um, but it's just, I've always been such an emotional person and I've always found, um, cleansing from crying. I feel like it is the most cleansing thing you can do. Even when you're angry, um, just cry and you feel so much better. Um, so it sounds weird and kind of sounds bad, but I think after this video, I'm going to just sit here a little bit longer and, um, kind of cry it out. Cause I feel like when you just have so much going on in your life and you don't check in on yourself, you just have so much built up. And I feel like everyone just once in a while needs to cry, um, to just kind of get more of a level head and feel better. Um, and definitely, uh, stay hydrated. Please stay hydrated. Um, summer is hot out and if you're going to be crying, stay hydrated, <laughs> drink your water. It's a very good idea. Um, but this place that I'm at, um, it's the best place to go. As you can see behind me, uh, that you probably have been wondering. Yes, I am in a cemetery, but it is not a well-visited cemetery. Um, because a well-visited part is... Um, there's kind of like a border, I guess, like the big, most visited part, uh, is, it, it has like this line of trees at the end of it. And then there's this little road that you drive past the trees and you come to this old cemetery and there's not many, there's not many, um, graves here. Um, and it's really old, so no one ever really comes here. And so... A lot of times I do come here just to also visit the graves and kind of pay respects and just kind of visit them because I don't know if anybody visits them anymore. So I try to do my part, <laughs> um, but also just get some clarity out here. As you guys can hear, there's not much sounds besides nature and it is the most beautiful place to be. I love coming here more than anything and I'm going to try to make it a habit to come here more. But I wanted to make this video to kind of remind you guys to do this type of self-care. Like, go by yourself, cry it out, meditate it out, do what you have to do. Um, and I feel like I don't care who you are. It is so good to spend time in nature. Um, even if it's nature like this, you don't have to be like deep in the woods or anything. Just sit on the ground, take your shoes off, put your hands in the grass and just feel the grass, lay in the grass. Just touch the ground with your body and just be one with it um i feel like that is because you know we we come from earth and we're earthly beings and we just need to be one with it for a minute and so it sounds really hippie but that's how i built that's what i believe um so do this type of self-care as well as the general like take a bath and listen to music and stuff um, remember, just also sit in silence and just clear your mind. Because um, right now the world is crazy and I think we all could benefit from it. So definitely take some time for you and uh, be in nature and just clear your head <laughs> and feel better. But yeah, uh, so I'm going to sit here for a little bit longer and I will talk to you guys later.